Kevin Systrom He is the CEO and co-founder of Instagram He was born on December 30, 1983, in Holliston, Massachusetts, United States His father's name was Douglas Systrom and mother's name was Diane Systrom he received education from the Middlesex School, located in Concord, Massachusetts. During his school days, he learned about computer programming. As a child, he played the video game called Doom 2, which further developed his interest in programming. He pursued Bachelor of Science degree in Management Science and Engineering from the Stanford University. While at the university, he was associated with the Sigma Nu fraternity. He was one among the 12 students selected by the university authorities to take part in the renowned Mayfield Fellows Program, where the students are provided with detailed knowledge and training in high-tech entrepreneurship. His participation in the fellowship program provided him an opportunity to join the company called Odeo as an intern. Odeo is the same company which developed the social networking site Twitter. In 2006, he completed his graduation and got employed at the internet service and technology giant Google as the associate product marketing manager and managed functions of Google Calendar, Gmail, Spreadsheets, Docs, and various other products of the company. During his two years of employment at Google, he initially worked with products such as Google Reader and Gmail. The following year, he joined the corporate development team of the company. A few individuals who had worked with Google, such as Adrian Graham, Charles Lin and Carlos Joe Green collaborated to form a new venture called Next Stop. Kevin left Google and became an associate at the new venture. This startup was developed to recommend destinations to people and help them explore the places with the help of Next Stop. This company was overtaken by the social networking site Facebook on 25th September 2010. This exceptional programmer conceived that the location check-ins can be amalgamated with prevalent social games, and on this thought, he prepared a prototype. He shared his idea with the founders of the capital investment companies Andreessen Horowitz and Baseline Ventures. His meeting with those founders seemed fruitful, and he left the next stop company to develop his idea further. The investment companies Andreessen Horowitz and Baseline Ventures provided him with an initial funding of $500,000. Eventually, the Burpum company was developed by Systrom and Mike Riedgerin in San Francisco. Burpum had many features, such as posting pictures, sharing locations, create future check-ins, and even accumulate points based on their activities on Burpum. However, the founder soon realized that the application with its enormous features was not user-friendly. The developers of Burpum decided to change the features of the application and make it more user-friendly by concentrating on only one feature, that is, sharing and posting of pictures. Thus, ushered in the new application called Instagram, and within one month of its launch the application, had around 1 million users. Instagram, which is a phone-based application, derived its name from the words Instant and Telegram. The application is integrated to the device's camera and gallery and one can edit their images with the help of inbuilt templates and settings and post it on various other social media platforms, including Facebook, Twitter, etc. The popularity of the application was so immense that, in April 2012, the social networking site Facebook acquired the company for $1 billion. 
Kevin, apparently earned $400 million owing to his shares in Instagram. Kevin holds the office of the CEO of Instagram, while Krieger is the technical head of the company. Kevin is bestowed with the handling of the nitty-gritty of the operations and the strategic development of the process. Although Facebook has acquired Instagram, Kevin still has a say in its operations and functioning. This pioneering program are married to Nicole Schuetz, who is the founder of the Sutro Energy Group. Do what you love and do it well, that's much more meaningful than any metric. Said Kevin Sivestrom.